Hey guys. Hello everyone. Hey, today we're gonna take you over to Edgemont. We have a one of the model homes over there that we wanna show you and just kind of, you know, we kind of touched on that uh, the other day and we sent out a video uh, showing you three of the newer uh, builders out here. So now we're gonna kind of dive into it more and talk a little bit more about it and, uh, you know, show you around. Yeah, this is a DR Horton community that uh, we've been waiting on, so we're excited to show you. Yeah, it was like, what, two years in the making? Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, we're going to talk about Edgemont today, and uh, stay tuned. We'll be right back. I always like to show you where things are located. So you have US 27. If you go north, that'll bring you up to Lake Louisa State Park. It'll bring you up to uh, Highway 50 and Waterfront Park and all the fun things over there. Lots of lakes on the way up there, more rolling hills. And if you go south, that'll bring you over to 192, which heads right into Disney World. And I call it Restaurant Row and all the fun things out there, Margaritaville. But right here, Edgemont is right before you get to Palms at Saranoa. And in 2026, we've talked about a lot where that road will open up and bring you right into Western Way, which brings you over to Disney, or you can go up Avalon and go to Winter Park, I'm sorry, Winter Garden, or you can get on the 429. So it's great access and that will be opening in 2026. Now we're driving up Sawgrass Bay Boulevard and turning right into Edgemont. This is right next to the Palms at Saranoa as well. So we're going into this, we refer to it as a small community because there's only going to be 92 homes in here. Yeah, and in here the HOA is 105 a month and there is a CDD which is in your taxes. Um, right beyond this uh, community is the Palms at Saranoa. You know we talk about that all the time. That's a 55 plus community and uh, hey, they're almost sold out. But let's get back to Edgemont. We've been waiting for this community for a couple years to start building, but they have in here four models to choose from. And uh, we'll go through that in a minute, but you can get anything from 1672 square feet to 2601 square feet. So, you know, there's a size for everyone in here. And I feel like it's more of a boutique type community. Now, before we take you on a tour, we wanted to remind you that we don't work for or represent the builder, that we're just local realtors here to give you great information about communities like these. And remember, if you want to be buyer represented, someone to have your back, you need to call us first because if you walk in or register without an agent, you can no longer be represented by an agent. So it's always good practice to have someone on your side. The sales reps work for the builder. So uh, give us a call. Today we're going to show you the Cali. This is a, a really great model. Um, this is the only one they have. And excuse the mess, the sales rep was working in this room the day we recorded. This is, a, the Cali is a nice home. It's a four bedroom, two bath. It also has a two car garage and the square footage is 1828. So they do have three different elevations that they offer with this model. Now the lot sizes in this community are 50 by 110 and the base price is starting at 434000 So remember, there should be additional uh, costs that will be added to that. Now this room here, uh, this could be either uh, the fourth bedroom or a den. So depending on what you're looking for, what you need, this is a great space for an office or you know a fourth bedroom. Um, they also say that cable and internet is included. Um, and one thing we didn't touch on is they have an amazing clubhouse in this community. You know, um, this community has been around for a little while. So there were several builders in the beginning uh, to make up Saranoa. So Edgemont is kind of one of the last, as we can see it, right? Some of the la one of the last places to go in there. They're also building down the road, not too far. They have plans of, uh, a grocery store coming in and once that road opens up off Sawgrass Bay you're going to be able to get right into Winter Garden and uh, over to Disney pretty quickly. We like to say that this home is connected because you have smart home capability. 
You're able to uh, control speakers, the front doorbell, the thermostat, light switches, and it has a home hub for all, all these features. So yes, it really is a smart home. And contact us because they've had some great incentives uh, as this has just opened up, but those won't last. They change from week to week. So give us a call and we'll let you know what the current status is of the, of the perks. Let's go over the models that are in this community. This is the area. This is a three bedroom, two bath, two car garage, 1,672 square feet, and the starting price is 424,000. You do get two elevations to choose from. Now we wanted to review the model we just showed you. It's the Kelly. It's the four bedroom, two bath, two car garage, 1,828 square feet, and three different elevations. Starting price, remember, is 434,000. You know, these two models would not be bad uh, that we just showed you for people retiring or people that wanted to downsize into a smaller home. Not everyone wants to go 55 plus, but you will have some amazing amenities that we'll show you. And I uh, just wanted to throw that one in. Now let's talk about the two stories that they offer. This is the Inslee. This is a four bedroom, three bath, two car garage, 2371 square feet, and the price starts at 474,000, and you have two elevations to choose from. Now the fourth model and the last that we have to show you is the Hayden. This is a big two story. It's a five bedroom, three bath, two car garage, 2,601 square feet, there are two different elevations and the starting price is 499000 Jumping over to their amazing clubhouse, you truly feel like you're on vacation. They offer so much to their residents. Uh, this is a room that your activities director will be in. You can go lounge and enjoy the day. This room is great because you can actually rent it. So if you have any special events or anything that you want to do privately, this is a rentable room. You know, the amenities are amazing uh, in this clubhouse. Uh, look at the weight room. I mean, this is the type of things that you see in 55 plus. They usually go over the top with what they offer, you know? Yeah, and this is just half of the weight room. I had to be careful there were people in there but they also have a great area for the kids to play and this is a pretty unique little gym, jungle gym yeah. or you know it's not your typical swing so kids really love this but this is a 6700 square foot clubhouse uh, again they have a uh, fitness center they have a community uh, director um, they have programs all the time. We've been over there where they've been uh, having fun with the, the families out in the front. They have plant, planned events. They have, we've seen food trucks over there. Yeah, there's like a rolling lawn that they can do events on. It's really nice. Yeah, and they also have 16 acres of open space. Um, so there's so much to do in this community. Thank you for joining us on our tour today of Edgemont by DR Horton. Always exciting when we talk about new things in the area. So if you're thinking of coming our, to our area, call, text, or email us. We'd love to have a phone conversation, whether you're ready now or in the future. And we do want to thank you for watching our videos. We truly appreciate you, and we just thank you for watching. And uh, stay tuned. we got more coming your way, and we'll see you soon.